Scoliosis. It's a problem from all the way to young teens, to older adults, to our elderly population. I'm Dr. Zach Shaw with the Upper Cervical Spine Center, and in our office, we see lots of patients with this condition called scoliosis. So, what is scoliosis? Scoliosis is an abnormal curvature in the spine when looking side to side, okay? So looking at me this way, it should be a nice straight spine, but in someone with scoliosis, you're gonna see curves, okay? And these curves cause problems because it pinches on certain nerves that go to vital organs. It causes abnormal muscle contractions, which can cause pain throughout the spine. And so this is definitely a common condition and it can be very, very detrimental, okay? Unfortunately, the medical approach to this is they start off with bracing. So they see the abnormal curves and they put a brace on your spine and they try to bring that spine back to normal, okay? But very, very rarely does that help. And unfortunately, the scoliosis gets worse and worse and worse to the point where medicine recommends surgery. And the surgical look of this is a big scar down your back and iron rods going through your spine. And unfortunately, it just doesn't have the best long lasting results. So that's why people with scoliosis come to us is because we get to the cause of that scoliosis we start correcting that cause and we see the scoliosis go away, okay? What we found almost 100% of the time is the cause of the scoliosis is a misalignment in the top of the neck. Let me show you with this little chart behind me, okay? What we can see here is a misalignment at the top of the neck throws the head off center, okay? When that happens, the brain is not level and the brain doesn't like this. So the brain tells the spine to compensate in order to balance the head. What these compensations look like over time is a dropped shoulder, a raised hip, tight hamstrings, a raised foot, and that spine starts to form this abnormal curvature or scoliosis, okay? Now, when we catch this in adulthood, usually what happens is we have shoulder pain, hip pain, knee pain, foot pain. We start correcting this bone and that pain usually goes away, okay? But if the scoliosis starts in the prepubescent years, so 11, 12, 13 years old, okay? And we start to, that bone's been misaligned, okay? And then the, then the person goes through puberty, they grow very rapidly and all of a sudden that spine gets really, really bad. That's when we see the childhood scoliosis. That's when you see people who never got it corrected with the hunchbacks or they're leaning this way or that way. Okay, so it's imperative that we get our kids into a chiropractor, specifically an upper cervical doctor, so we can get this bone checked out. We can see the entire spine, see if scoliosis is starting to form and correct the cause, which is at the top of the neck before it gets any worse. And then of course, if you're an adult and you're experiencing certain things, we can also take a look at this bone, start correcting it, and you will see the spine start to straighten out over time, okay? So, if you or a loved one has scoliosis, whether you're 13 years old or you're 113 years old, please, please, please call our office at 704-588-5560. We will be happy to do a consult completely free of charge. We'll do an exam, take some x-rays, and see exactly what's going on with your spine to see if it's an upper cervical issue and something we can help you with. If you're not in the Charlotte, North Carolina area, give our office a call anyway, and I promise we will find an upper cervical doctor as close to you as possible. I hope you enjoyed this talk, and I hope you have a wonderful day.